Okay, this is the polyethylene tubing that I use for the raised strawberry bed or the raised beds. It's black plastic. It is half inch diameter as well and it came in this roll. I think it was about 12 or 15 bucks at Lowe's and so I just cut off the lengths I needed. I just scored it with a utility knife when I measured what I wanted and then I just used a wood saw to just saw right through it because it's it's firm but reasonably soft but it's more flexible than regular PVC pipe is. You know the white kind of PVC pipe and so that's what I did down there as I put it on the strawberry bed. It's working all right so I want to use it for the other bed as well if I need it for maybe a cold frame or or even netting or things like that. So that's the polyethylene tubing. This is a length test. This is that half inch polyethylene pipe put in the tube holders and this is about um, seven feet long. But you can see it looks like it would give a decent amount of cover if I needed to put netting on top of the strawberries. Okay, here's the raised strawberry bed with three hoops here, seven feet long, half inch polyethylene. Let's see if I can put some net on there to keep the keep the birds away from it because I see there's a couple good strawberries there, ready to come out. One there, and one there. I'd rather not have them eaten yet. Here's the the Velcro uh, plant wrap stuff I used to to secure the netting to the hoops basically you see it just kind of rips off and you cut what you need and fold it back on itself and then it, you can easily just adjust it and take it on and off whatever you need so it's kind of a some velcro plant wrap strapping I guess it'd be called all right here's the finished product with some netting on it I just used some wrap over velcro plant ties and you can see here some of the netting just tied onto them and then it slides up and down if I need to adjust anything but this stays on in the wind pretty well and now it has kind of a little bird shield around it so we'll give that a shot and see how that works for being able to get the uh, strawberries out of it yeah and then maybe that way I don't have to worry about them getting eaten before we get a chance to eat them ourselves so as long as there's not snails or other things too obviously that will help All right, now that I got the strawberry netting set up, we need to work on getting the blueberry netting set up. We have our four blueberry plants, and uh, we can definitely see some blueberries are coming, which is awesome. Some of them had that cold spell in the spring. Some parts of the plants, you know, they kind of lost those flowers, but you know, there's a lot of these new ones that have some, some blueberries on the way, so I'd really think I might do something with one half inch PVC to help the blueberries keep them safe from the birds so we can actually eat them.